Hi, this is Diane Cossey, Creative Offer at MLM, and this is video number three about creating a uh, self hosted blog on the HostGator control panel, or cPanel for short. And we've now created um, by changing the name servers from our original purchase of our new domain name from GoDaddy, we've now changed the name servers across from um, the GoDaddy ones to the HostGator ones and then we have actually added the domain name and what this does is it creates a file in the back section of cPanel which will now be the little house if you like for everything that you're going to do within that domain name so if you're going to build a website uh, you would then store all your files for building the website and upload to the file that has now been created. So there's a now there is a new folder in the back office here and it's always public HTML and there you can see there is a new folder for our new domain name with nothing in it at the moment. So we're going to go back to the C panel and we're not going to build, be building a website, we're actually going to be building a um, WordPress blog. So there's a really nifty little tool in the back of these um, control panels. And if you scroll down to the little smiley face, which is Fantastico, Deluxe, and then you're onto the main menu here and it says click on any of the items on the left to get more details. So it's going to be a WordPress blog. So I'm going to click WordPress. It's going to open up into um, support form and then we're going to click new installation, which is what it is. And then we're just going to wait for that to tell itself to load up into a new, new window. And then what we're going to do is hopefully complete the installation of the uh, WordPress standard blog software to this new domain name if it ever loads, which will be the new membership blog. Now it's given me the install and domain as domain default, but actually I want to install it inside that domain which will take it into the folder that I just showed you in the in the section previous to this so that is going to be done so I'm going to install the blog I'm going to leave this empty because they're going to automatically put it in for me username but I'm going to have to thinky Bobby out I'm going to have to block this out I can see you're going to see <laughs> the password. That's not very, not very um, well protected. So we'll be blocking that out when we make this live. And then admin nickname. I'm just going to call it Diane. And then description. I'm actually going to put. It doesn't really matter. But I'm actually just going to put in team team blog and then I'm going to click install WordPress and then as with all things we need to just finalize uh, you've chosen to install the main directory of the domain go big or go home and then the URL will be go big or go home team.com and then click finish the installation and that will then be live ready to be made all sorts of um, loveliness with all the plugins um, so that's it Diane signing out